hello fox so today uh, in this video i will talk about very interesting topic which is how you can uh, migrate a small angular component from traditional zone js based chain detection to modern zone less zone less with signals so what it do basically uh, like means the signals we can use signals uh, in our application and we can migrate any uh, component to the zone less and uh, it basically means improve the performance also of the application so if you see here so what you do currently so you do this like like when you this is a normal currently approach that we are using so chain detection run automatically because zone js patches the click event so uh, this is the normal approach that we follow currently so we can also do that so we can convert uh, that uh, into the zone less also so can achieve that so to achieve that what you can do you can just simply enable the zone less mode in your application and in this zone less mode application what you can do you can just uh, in the providers just update the this uh, import like providers experimental zone less interaction and uh, just import the component that you want to put then what you need to do then what uh, means then just update your component also so in the component what we are doing we are just uh, using the count like now we are using signal so here we just created a signal we are just updating the signals using this so uh, this is the way you can uh, achieve that with the zone less also so how it improve the performance so let me show you like uh, you will clearly see the difference uh, how it is different uh, how it improve the performance. so firstly understand what are the benefits so we, it basically faster updates no unnecessary renders full control control over state and uh, updates and remove unnecessary dependency on zone js so if you see now if you see this here so what i have done so i just created a simple component that i shown you the code like simple count and in that what we are doing so if you see here this is a standalone component and here we are just bootstrapping this uh, zone JS. So this is zone JS based component. So here, if you see here, this is a simple component, and here this is standard component that you are seeing here. And uh, this is the code that we added. This is a normal code that we generally use follow. So here, if you see here, chain detection count is one. Okay. So means this is the zone based zone JS based component, and uh, I am comparing it with the zone less component. So you you, you will see the clearly the difference. Like uh, so in this zone JS based component, we have a chain detection one time. So now if you see this zone, this is zone less. So I am enabling the zone less component. So if you see now, what is the difference here? So here, like I just, here the same code is added of the count. Means if you see here, this is, there is a getter and there is a property that is getting incremented. And uh, it is a standalone component also. And uh, now let's go 